Caregiver's Guide, How to Pivot Transfer from a Bed to a Bedside Commode. Pivot transfers are essential for safely moving our loved one from one surface to another, such as from a bed to a bedside commode. Let's walk through the steps. Before you begin, gather all necessary supplies and ensure the area is clear of obstacles to prevent accidents. Put on gloves for hygiene and position the bedside commode next to the bed for easy access after the transfer. Make sure you have all supplies needed for toileting, such as toilet paper, wipes, and creams as needed. Communication is crucial. Explain the transfer process to your loved one and reassure them of their safety throughout. Your loved one should have socks with grips or slippers to ensure their feet will not slide when getting up. Help your loved one sit up on the edge of the bed, ensuring they're stable and balanced before proceeding. To help your loved one sit up, place their feet on the edge of the bed, then ask them to help push themselves up. You can assist by holding onto their shoulders and gently guiding them to a sitting position. Next, place the gait belt around the patient's waist securely. This will provide you with a firm grip during the transfer. Make sure your loved one is sitting on the edge of the bed with their feet flat on the ground. The pivot technique involves turning your loved one's body as a unit while maintaining their balance and support. Review the process with your loved one prior to transferring. Assist your loved one to stand using the gate belt for support. Do not allow your loved one to wrap their arms around your neck. This will cause them to tug on you and could injure you. Instead, have them use their arms to press themselves off the bed. If they want, they can place their hands on your hips. Then, pivot them towards the bedside commode in a smooth motion. Guide your loved one to feel the bedside commode behind them and to place their hands on the armrests. Then assist them in lowering down to the bedside commode. Continue to hold onto the gate belt, bending at your knees as you lower your loved one onto the bedside commode. Before your loved one sits down, they can remove their pants. If your loved one is unsteady, you can assist with removing their pants and undergarments. Ensure that they have been lowered enough so your loved one does not sit on their clothing when they sit down on the bedside commode. Ensure your loved one is comfortable and properly positioned. Once your loved one is seated, ensure they are comfortable and balanced on the bedside commode. Privacy is important, but if your loved one is confused or weak, stay in the room with them to ensure they are safe. When your loved one is ready to get back to bed, you will repeat the same process. Start by using the gate belt, then ask your loved one to place their hands on the bedside commode to help push themselves up. Once they are standing up, you can assist them with getting clean. Apply any creams if ordered at this time. Assist your loved one with pulling up their undergarments and pants. Now that your loved one is ready, review the pivot process with them, reminding them not to place their hands around your neck, but on your hips. Using the gate belt, pivot the patient from the bedside commode to the bed. Ensure that your loved one's legs are touching the back of the bed and then ask them to place their hands behind them and lower themselves to the bed, using their hands to assist them down gently. Remind your loved one to remain leaning forward and not to drop into the bed or lean backwards. This could be uncomfortable. Once your loved one is back in bed, remove the gate belt and socks or slippers. If your loved one can lay down independently, ask them to do so. If they need assistance, have them lay back as you bend over and with your knees bent, swing their legs back into the bed. Now that your loved one is back in bed, ensure they are comfortable. Reposition as needed. With practice and attention to detail, you can safely pivot transfer your loved one from a bed to a bedside commode, ensuring their comfort and well-being. For more information on how to assist a loved one from a bed to a bedside commode, review in the TapCloud app in the HOP resource library. If you still have questions about how to assist a loved one from a bed to a bedside commode after viewing this video, please contact Hospice of the Piedmont for more information.